Hello everybody, welcome to the finale of 007 Agent Under Fire. Uh, today we're going to be beating Poseidon, Mediterranean Crisis, and Evil Summit. This is probably going to be the longest episode just because they really love dragging out these last few levels. They just... Urgh, they just... they drag. They drag on and on. So anyway, you hop in this area and you're like, Huh, well, uh, this place looks weird, but, uh... I'm uh, not even going to bother. Okay, so let's hop aboard the Q-Laser and hit up this thing. There you go. There you go. Let's silence it because we got this guy who, uh, let's blast him in the skull. I can run up and grab his magnum. Uh, do we have the cue decryptor? Yes, we do. Hey, you, stop! Hey, I got some grenades. Some gun ammo. Nothing over there. Any other secrets? No. Okay, never mind. Okay, there's no more secrets. Boop. Open this door. There you go. Yeah, give me pistol ammo, thank you. Alright, alright, this level, this area does this to you. Alright, watch, you want to pull out this gun because you have some ammo in it. Check out this bull honky. You're like, hey, this level's gonna be friggin' awesome. You look at these tubes. You're like, sweet. Here's some super thugs, have fun. If you aren't careful for those super thugs, they will kill you. They will just instantly destroy you with that submachine gun. Wow, just going for headshots, like, even if you have to just... Even if you have to stand there and do it, you know? It, it makes everything roll by just a little bit faster. Okay. Oh, is this the area that sucks? Oh, no, it's not. It's actually a fade-in, meaning that I can respawn there. Okay. Oh, I don't like this area. I don't like this area. I'm going to need a gun. But one of the particularly gold variety. Because I need to be sneaky. right there. Carbon. Or not. Oh, it makes sense to me. in this room oh jesus see a metal gear you would have gotten fucked in the and the- oh shit. Okay, yep, I just got insta-killed because the fucking barrels are right there. Oh, that means I get to do that all over. Oh. Really, all this sneaking around shit? Alright. 
Fine, you walk over there. I missed two shots for particularly no reason. Alright, here we go. Right, for some reason, you don't attract the attention of everybody else. And you are dead. I go around. Shoot these guys. Oh fuck, I don't want to venture too far over there, because then... I'm gonna get rid of those barrels when the super thug comes out. Cause I don't feel like getting exploded today. Wow, only two lives. This sucks. Okay. Did I get all the programs? I just want to make sure that I scrizzity scraped this whole room. Alright, here we go. So is this the area that I do not like? Yes, it is. Well, that's not a beginner's trap or anything. Yeah, I'm a little dead. I'm a little dead, so I have to do that all the room again. Ugh. I don't know what you're supposed to do to not kill yourself over there. Fuck it. Fuck it. At this point, fuck blending it more. <laughs> Oh, so they literally just come over here. Let's whip out our PS100, and pew, 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 you're dead. There. Ah, kablammo. Just in case I need health. Actually, what's the point?
So how to next area without dying? On number one, key remote. Then they do that jazz. Fuck it, we're going in. There you go. Okay. Yeah, you want to do that so that the next level goes by a little smoother. Alright. Cue Decryptor. Hit that up. Alright. Let's try not to die. I always die in this section just because it's just... It's stressful. Okay. It's, it's really stressful. Um... Oh yeah, don't they walk in and you just get a sniper in the face? Yeah, that's what happens. They find you anyway. Just trying not to get snippety sniped here. What the hell? How am I already this hurt? Oh, I never knew about this. There we go. Yes. So anyway, then you see... Zoe. And you're like, what? I seem to recall you being killed in Hong Kong, Miss Nightshade. James, that was a clone. Created to gain information from you about what MI6 knows about Poseidon, and then to infiltrate the CIA. She was not meant to die. That rocket... Was intended for you. Input navigation code. Enter verification code. Commencing dive sequence. Yeah, if you don't have the verification card, um, the thing just gasses you. But if you do have the code, they get it down. It just depends on what you want to see and how you want to spawn in the next level. Ammo efficiency, nothing. Oh my god. Oh, finally, somebody beat this. Thank you. Alright. There you go. The HMS Excalibur. 
There you go. At least I get three tries on the level. Dear God, three tries. Thank you. Having to do all of that and one continue was just fucked up. All right. So anyway, yeah, so you have Zoe right here, which means uh, they spawn you with a shotgun and some health nearby. But here's the thing. They, they literally spawn it in the stupidest place. Whoop bap whoop boop whoop boop Ouch Why did you have to shoot me, good sir? You know those lightly sting. Alright. Yeah, this is where you would have spawned with um if you didn't have the code. You would have to use the Q laser to get up and around, but uh of course not. Right. No, oh, Jesus! Okay, I nearly just died, but then again, I hopped in and grabbed those. Grenades? No, no grenades. Okay, fuck. Yeah, in their infinite wisdom, they decide to arm a nuke on the ship. Because... Yeah, that's literally the... the... Ow! Stop shooting me. Stop doing that, please. Uh. Alright, let's pull out the Q remote. How do you get over there? How do you do it? Boop. Oh. Oh cool, he can withstand multiple headshots. Alright, that's it, you fucker. Get a shotgun in the chest for all I care. There you go, okay. Well now there's literally no point to getting the jet program because I just shirt shot everybody in there. I'm liking this shotgun, actually. Oh, I didn't actually get sniped. Awesome. Makes a whole lot of things flick a lickin' easier. Alright, doesn't Zoe blab on a little bit here? Why not? Where am I? Did I go the wrong way? I have no clue where I'm going. Oh. Not even how you get the jet program. Yeah, good thing there's a friggin' super thug right there, dear Jesus. <sighs> okay.
Okay. Well, good thing there's this guy. And now bullets. Wow, doing this without the jet program is insanity. Stop shooting me, please. There you go. How did these people get here? Oh, thank you. That's what I was looking for. Okay. Oh yeah, this is the person who throws grenades down the stairs. They throw grenades down the stairs just because they feel like it. Oh, and there's a sniper. Just to make you feel even less comfortable. Oh yeah, right, there's a, there's a helicopter. There, they finally give up. Or not. Okay, there we go. Okay. Kapu. You. There you go. They got your American friend. Some rock looking chaps are holding her below in the depth charge bay. I'll open the door to the landing so you can get a better look. And then I can go gra get a grasp at you. Alright, so now we gotta get Zoe, who's um down there. And, oh no. Oh no. Let's be the hero. You can't shoot these barrels or you get insta-killed. Except she's dead, so I lost. Alright. Alright, reset the stage. I shot the barrels. God damn it. Ugh. That means I get to do all those shenanigans again. Stop that. It mildly irritates me. Shut up. I understand. Okay. Cable. I need the cable. Open the door so I get some air in here. Get this cable out before I lose you. 
and boop a boop. There. Much better. There you go. Okay. So, this time, how about we not screw up? How do I. I guess I need to save the um, shotgun for that. Oh my god, doing that in sync is just perfect. Oh yeah, insta kill them. Cool. <laughs> there we go, I finally did it. All it takes is one shot. There we go. Who are these people down here who keep shooting me? They need to stop doing that. Okay, hold on. I'm going to use the UGW. And then just... Uh, so I can take these guys out because... Jesus. There, I got him, finally, Jesus. Okay. So you know what I'm gonna do just to prolong this? This is the one time I'm gonna use, I'm gonna save state load because literally just because they implement her death there, it's like. I don't think they end other levels if you do that. So, uh, fuck it. Oh. Some rough little chaps are holding her below in the depth charge bay. I'll open the door to the landing so you can get a better look. There you go. I go scoop up the ammo. Okay. This is gonna be the only time you see me do this. Get your hands off me, you ape! Yeah, the hands that clearly are not on you. Okay. I'll top over here, Bobby Boopy. And and I fucked it up again. There. Thank you. I shouldn't be able to lose a level just because of that. There you go. Okay. Destroy helicopter. I've already done that once. I just did. I, I literally just did that. Like a few... Seconds ago. Boop. What? Double seven. We see helicopters on the flight deck. Now Grace Clovis are making their escape. Don't let them get away. Yeah, if they do get away, you also lose the level.
Okay, just random jet for no reason. Wow, this is a surely good sized finale, isn't it? Alright, next up is Evil Summit. This is the last level, and it by far is probably the hardest level. So, uh, there's no fucking around with this level. Yeah, a base high up in Switzerland. Yeah, that, that's it. You're going right back to where you first met Mal- where you, uh, you're going right back to Malprave. Which, I love this. I love this. Malprave's holding the world leader somewhere in this base. Have the jet ready and be prepared to meet me up at the top. So anyway, you're like, okay. Then check this out. There's just... There's just snipers everywhere. You must see that they do not come to harm. Good luck. Okay. That's fair, I guess. Wait, well, what? Oh, that's what you're supposed to do. Okay. I'm glad I almost just killed myself so I can get rid of some guys. That's... Boop. Boop. Uh, it's already out of ammo. Jesus. Is there ammo for it? No, so what do you do? And I love how your standard pistol literally just annihilates their soul. So now we need the Q remote, I think. It makes that jingle literally every single time. Okay, after almost nearly committing suicide... Which doing that leases the geeses. So, uh, be afraid. And you can see that this gun is just a um, poor man's G11. But nobody likes the G11, so who cares? Thank you. At this point, I'm gonna habitually save state because literally there's just no, there's no point to having limited continues in a game like this. Well, good thing it shows this area. Shoot. 
There you go. So you're like, okay. They're like, cool, I have one of the pro you have one of the leaders. That's fantastic. you have four of the leaders. It's fantastic. I'll find the other ones. No, you've gotta find literally all the other ones. And you're like Oh. Every single one of these people have silos. I used to give me some health, dear god. Nope, I'm dead. Or not, I'm not dead. So they accounted for people falling on their face. There you go. We got the French Prime Minister. Which is cool. Okay. Let's go over here. Yeah, a lot of this level is a whole lot of tedium. You know, because... Apart from those first few sections where they just try to gun you down constantly, you know... And the other world leaders just book it. They're like, they're like, uh, uh I've had enough of this shit. So they just, they disappear, basically. And doesn't matter what you do, they, you, you won't find them again. So it's like, are they dead? And it's like, no. There you go, the German Chancellor. There you go. Let's just ignore this barrel because fucking God knows what you can do by. Okay, never mind. The game was like, fucking, I got something to prove. And it's like. Fine. You wanna be tough? Where is this? Using the moon jump to my advantage. Alright. How much ammo is in this? Ah. Bullets upon bullets. My favorite thing. You tell me. What is best thing in world? A gun fully loaded. Boop. Go. The remote sometimes just, uh, doesn't cooperate. Oh, actually, doesn't this area have, like, a secret, like... Oh, yeah, it has, like, a little, um, hidden, uh, compartment over here. Or you can go up and shoot this thing. There you go, I just wanted the bullets. That's all I wanted. Literally all I wanted were the bullets. Okay. Sorry, Prime Ministers, but I need more... I Or, Prime Minister, World Leaders. Sorry, World Leaders. Uh, I, I just got some shooting to do. I have some shooting to do. How the fuck... How the hell do I do this? Uh, so apparently I didn't lose the level yet, so fuck it. Okay, the UK Prime Minister. So Bond definitely fucks with this guy. 
not. Oh. Somehow I got over there. I just did. How do I get back? Oh. Right. Okay, there. Oh, I got back. Oh, they give you all the Q gadgets? Alright. I'm supposing this just ends in a wall. Or not. Alright, so Silo 3 and 4 connect. They, they connect to each other. So why don't 1 and 2 do that? I guess they do, maybe. There's no way I'm gonna fuck this up. There you go, we saved the U.S. President. Alright, well, good thing I'm a fantastic acrobat. <clears throat> We're nearly killing myself. Or not, let's just break my legs first. Hold on, let's... There we go, okay. Amazing work. Now, you can go through here, where you see lift, and you're like, cool, lift button. And then you're like, oh no, I'm about to get crushed, but guess what? That doesn't happen. Instead, this happens. Congratulations, Mr. Bond. You've scored a few victories, but it's not over yet. I've set the base's missiles to self-destruct. Soon your ashes will be falling like snowflakes. In the meantime, an old friend would like to entertain you. Nigel was most unhappy that you eliminated his double. He would like to return the favor. God damn it, clones. All right, give me the music. So you need the Q jet. Stop. Shooting! Alright, I gotta hop down. I gotta hop down here because there's health. Or I can have a face full of rockets, that's good. Okay. So I triggered that bit. Oh, fuck. Alright. Every time I fuck this up. Every single time. I don't know why. And that's instant death. See, I don't know why. Literally, you just bounce off this thing constantly.
Oh, and then you have to cue claw. Okay. Makes sense, not really. Okay, there's literally nothing up here. End game time. Going through the tube. Going through the tube. So anyway, then you go in this room again. So it's over! We killed him! You blast Nigel with the rocket launcher. And then you're like, ugh. Silly Malprave, what were you thinking? So anyway, you're like, there is absolutely no way Bond could live that. But then he hops in the jet. And you're like, that doesn't work, but okay. And it's over. We've beaten it. The game is ended. And it just brings you to the mission screen. There you go. But don't worry. The D-pad. The game has its own credits. There you go. So, that was James Bond 007 Agent Under Fire. It's a pretty good game. Uh... It can get a bit frustrating at times, but overall it's a pretty solid game. Uh, if you don't really like the clunky controls of GoldenEye, this game, like, it might be a little better, but uh, compared to, like, FPSs of today, it's just kind of meh. So I'm going to stop talking just so I can play, just so I can stop the copyrighted music. So, I'll see you all next time. Only you can prevent forest fires.